Hey everybody, Mr. Dave here. We've got a great show for you today. But first, why don't we go down to the water hole? Jeff. Mm, Billy. Going down to the water hole to fill my jug. Gonna fill up my glass. Gonna fill up my mug. Gonna get a drink of water and sing like a bug. Going down to the water hole. Going down to the water hole to fill my jug. Gonna fill up my glass. Gonna fill up my mug. Gonna get a drink of water and sing like a bug. Going down to the water hole. Going down, down to the water hole to fill my jug. Gonna fill up my glass. Gonna fill up my mug. Gonna get a drink of water and sing like a bug. Going down to the water hole. Going down to the water hole to fill my jug. Gonna fill up my glass. Gonna fill up my mug. Gonna get a drink of water and sing like a bug. Going down to the water hole. to the theatre. Hmm. Today we have a wonderful performance all about pretending to be something else. So sit back, grab your popcorn, and enjoy the show. Hmm. Once upon a time, Harold was pretending to be a cowboy. Well, howdy. Um, howdy? It's mighty fine seeing y'all. I'm looking for some vittles, and I was wondering if y'all want to join me for a spell. Oh no, oh no, Harold is broken! Are you okay? Harold, Harold, are you Percy, okay? Percy, ah! Percy, Percy, I'm fine. I'm just pretending to be a cowboy. Oh, I was so worried. Whew. So, you're pretending. I imagining yourself to be a cowboy? Yep, I'm a rootin' tootin' horse riding, cattle wrangling, song singing cowpoke. Hee <laughs> Wow. Uh, Harold, do you mind if I pretend to be a cowboy too? Why, of course y'all can. <laughs> Howdy. Well, hooey! Ain't that something? Well, how about them vittles? Oh, uh, I'm sorry, but, uh,. What is a vittle? Oh, that's another way to say food. I'm hungry, and I was wondering if you'd like to join me. Oh. How do you say yes in cowboy? Hmm. I've always liked yip. Yep. Yip. Yep. Yip. Yep. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> Harold, what was that? Oh, that weren't nothing. I'm just so happy is all. So, I gave a hoot and holler. <laughs> this is all very confusing, um, partner. That it is, hombre. That it is. Let's skedaddle over to the saloon and get us some mates. Hmm. I wonder if there's a cowboy to English dictionary. Hey, fellas. Take a seat. I'll be right there. Hey guys, nice hats. Much obliged. Me and my compadre here are here for some grub. Ooh, are we pretending to be cowboys? Indeed we are. Oh, I mean, yep. <laughs> Wait one second. Well, howdy. What can I get you folks? Oh, you're good. Well, thank you kindly. 
So what can I get you folks? I can have Chef back there whip up some flapjacks for you right quick. Flap? Jacks? Pancakes. Oh, yes please. I mean, uh, yep. That sounds just fine. Alrighty, I'll put it in for y'all. Hey, Chef! Hey, Percy, did you know that there are tons of different kinds of cowboys and cowgirls all over the world? Well, that makes sense. I mean, a cowboy is a kind of a generic term for a person whose job is to care for cattle, and often farm hands in general. Seeing as there are cows and farms all over the world, it makes sense. Yeah, in Mexico, cowpokes are called vaqueros or charros. In Hawaii, they are called paniolo. In Spain, they are gauchos and chilan in Peru. The llanero of Venezuela and the huaso of Chile. Australian stockmen, ringers, jackaroos, and jillaroos are all what we call cowboys. That is so fascinating. And might I add, good research. In the French Camargue, they're called Guardian. In Hungary, they're known as Chicoche and Gulyash. And the cattle wranglers of Tuscany, Italy are called Buteri. I was wondering if you fellas would like to listen to a traditional cowboy ballad while y'all are waiting for your flapjacks. That would be right nice. Well, alrighty then. Give me a home where the buffalo roam and the deer and the antelope play. Where seldom is heard a discouraging word and the skies are not cloudy all day. Home, home on the range where the deer to low play where seldom is heard a discouraging word and the skies are not cloudy all day word and the skies are not cloudy all day and the skies are not cloudy all day that was right pretty thank you kindly wow great accent percy <laughs> And so Harold, Percy, and Mr. Dave all had fun pretending to be cowboys and ate pancakes. Uh, flapjacks. Happy trails! <laughs> How much fun was that? It was really cool pretending to be a cowboy and learning about what cowboys are called in all sorts of different places. Maybe you could pretend to be a cowboy or a cowgirl too. Well, I hope you had fun today. I know I sure did. And now I've got one more song for you. My favorite way to say goodbye is not goodbye to you. Not adios, arrivederci, sayonara, or adieu. My favorite way to say goodbye, the best way that I knew. My favorite way to say goodbye is to say that I love you. See you next time. Yeah. <laughs>
Fun Time with Mr. Dave has been brought to you by HilltownFamilies.org, YoYoSam.com, The Arms Public Library, The Buckland Public Library, and CFCE of the Mohawk Trail and Hollamont Regional School District. Don't forget you can write to Mr. Dave and Friends at P.O. Box 29 in Shelburne Falls, Massachusetts, 01370. Well, I hope you had fun today. I did it again. I'll wait for the mail truck to leave. Such a tiny little truck makes so much noise. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. Mm hmm Can't move my head too much or my hat falls off, but that's okay. Mm hmm Today we have a wonderful tale all about pretending to be something else. Today, oh. Yep. Oh no, my hat, my hat, my hat, my hat, my hat. Ah! I lost my hat. Thank you kindly. Well, what can I get you folks? I can have Chef back there whip up some pants. <laughs> Oh, and somebody's making noise. Okay, let's do it again. Hello, and welcome to the... That sounds just fine. Oh, my hat's falling off. It's mighty fine seeing y'all looking for some... Ugh. Hmm, hmm. He dropped the script. Hmm, hmm. Oh, that ain't there. That sounds just fine. Oh, my hat again. <sighs> I was wondering if y'all would like to hear. <laughs> Much obliged. Me and my compadre here are here for some. <laughs> Can't read my hand. Read the script. Okay. <sighs> okay. From oh, and the hat. Yikes. Oh, that weren't. <clears throat> That sounds just fine. There's a plow going by. <laughs> we might sound like we're in the Old West, but there's four inches of snow outside. <laughs> My hat's gonna fall off again. That it is, hombre. That it is. Let's skedaddle and get over to the... <laughs> yeah, in Mexico? <laughs> yeah, in Mexico? <laughs> I was wondering if you fellas would like to listen to a traditional cowboy ballad while you're all away. Rawr, 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 rawr. Australian stockmen, ringers, jackaroos, and jillaroos. Uh, jillaroos? Jillaroos. <laughs> I was wondering if you fellas would like to listen to a traditional cowboy ballad while you're all waiting for your pla plap. <laughs> plap. Plap. Mm. The Australian stockmen, ringers, jackaroos, and jillaroos are all what we call cowboys and cow- There goes my hat again! I don't think this hat was such a good idea, guys. I mean, I know it's a cowboy hat and all, and this episode's about cowboys, but still. <laughs> I got my hat back.